Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In today's video is we're gonna learn about how to use Calendly API. So for the first step for this one is you'll just need to head onto the no code API. So you need to log in onto your account for that. Or if you don't have an account yet, you need to sign up. So once you have already signed up, you'll just need to head onto the marketplace for that one. Once you're already onto the marketplace, you need to search onto the application in here, Calendly. So if you don't have this one yet, so I have activated this. So you should see something like this. You'll have to click onto that so that it would be activated. And then right after to set this up, you'll just have to use this API. So as you can see, it is successfully added and there is no Calendly API as of the moment. So I'll just need to create onto this button to get started for that. And you need to authenticate this first with your Calendly account. So you'll have to click on to authenticate following the prompts for that one so that you could go ahead and try to log in first for that. So I'll just need to finish this one. And then you should be able to see this connect to um, Calendly. So continuing will enable the no code API application to connect your account. So we're going to go ahead and connect that. And then right after, we'll just have to wait for this and then you'll get redirected back again onto no code API and it will go ahead and authenticate. So right after, you'll just have to um, choose the account, give it a name like my API or my Calendly, anything you like, and then click on to create. And as you can see, API has been created successfully. And that's just basically it on to setting up Calendly onto your no code API. If you think this has been helpful to you, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and we'll see you on to your next video.